Now let's look at the extensor surface of the upper limb. The arm is easy. And when I say the arm, I mean the humerus, because we are talking about the triceps muscle. Okay. But when we look at the forearm, <clears throat> we have to look a little bit more closely. We have to look at where the tendons insert, and that will help us to tell not only what the muscle does, but what it's called. So we can still see here the flexor carpi ulnaris muscle. We turn just a little bit, and now we have the extensor carpi ulnaris. And so we can see that this muscle contracting is going to flex the wrist and pull towards the ulnar side. Then we have more extensor muscles, but where do they attach, or where do they um, go to? Effect. These muscles, when they contract here, are going to cause the digits, the fingers, to extend. So this is extensor digitorum. This little one you don't have to know, but it's just extensor digiti minimi, I like saying the, the name. But extensor digitorum. <clears throat> now we have to extend the wrist to the um, radial side. And we have two major muscles that do that. And so we have extensor carpi longus radialis longus. Extensor carpi radialis longus and extensor carpi radialis brevis. Same action, but a longer muscle. All right, and these muscles, you don't have to know, but we can see what they're going to extend. The thumb, that's right. So, extensor pollicis. And there's longus and brevis. And, but those are the major extensors of the upper limb.